Scar, it's time to wake up. You have an appointment to go to. Hey, buddy. He's so dark, you can barely see him on the camera. Hold on. Hey, Maine Coon. You get to go to the vet today. Isn't that so exciting? Isn't that so exciting? I know. What is good, Mama Squad, and welcome back to our channel. I am literally 10 minutes away from taking this dude to the vet to get his last round of shots for the year. I know it sounds crazy, but he's already over three months old. Like, we got him when he was only, oh my gosh, he was only seven weeks. That's crazy. That's the youngest kitten we've ever had out of all of our family's cats. But he is inclined for his next booster shots, I think, for, I think it's maybe like heartworm, rabies shots, something like that. But when cats are kittens, and I know this goes for dogs too and all young animals, they need like a good immune system boost and they get that through the veterinarian shots. And this dude's already going back to bed. Dude, we have to leave at 10 minutes. Otherwise, we're gonna be late and you're not gonna be getting your nutrients in your body. You just sprawled out. All right, so I'm just gonna go get the cage. I'm gonna get ready. You keep sleeping, buddy. So I know you guys might be like, where's Mariah? Where is she? Like, where did she go? The house sounds empty. There's nobody here and it's dead quiet. So this girl actually went down to Naples today and she's currently on her way back, but she just informed me that she successfully purchased my wedding gift. Oh my gosh, this is so crazy because she hasn't told me what it is yet, but she says the wedding gift that she's gonna give me on our wedding day is gonna be so crazy. She had to drive down to Naples just to pick it up and I obviously can't have any knowledge about anything going on. All I know is that she's driving down to Naples, she picked it up, she's on her way back and I can't see it. Oh my, she said it's so, like she was texting me, she said it's so crazy that I'm literally going to like cry. Like she literally cannot believe that she even got this and I am like so anxious like if you you know you're anxious when you know you have a surprise coming like I wish I didn't even know that I had this coming but I do know there's something here so she'll be meeting us back in a little bit I have to take this dude to the vet though because she's not gonna be actually able to make it back before we go there hopefully everything goes good I'm really hoping because last time we had like a little scare with things with scar and we didn't know what was going on but we also do have some news to show you and I know by the title of this video y'all are really curious on what's going on trust me this sh is crazy you guys are gonna want to watch this whole video all the way through me and Mariah are gonna sit down for a second and talk about what actually happened with Scar I'm not gonna say much but it's crazy and just stay tuned for that oh and as you guys know snap absolutely hates the crate he already ran and he's looking at me right now in the living room saying don't you come near me with that crate because he knows if he goes in this we're either going on a plane or we're taking him to the vet and snap doesn't really like going to the vet that much but Scar surprisingly likes this. Here he is. He's so cute. I've never had like a black cat since I was younger and I totally forgot how it's so hard to see them in certain lighting, like to see all their features, except like, you know, his ears and like his eye features and stuff. But look at him, he's so precious. <laughs> oh, <laughs> tell me you wanna go to the vet too? Only Scar Scar is going. Only Scar Scar, okay? All right, we're all ready to go, packed up. Let's get him in the car. This is actually gonna be his first time driving in the Corvette. I had to take the vet because Mariah took the other car. So Scar is about to whip in the vet with me. Are you ready, bro? Are you ready? You wanna go fast? Don't worry, I'm gonna be safe. <laughs> now I have to have him in the car before I open up the garage or even start the car because I don't want to scare him. I'm gonna open the garage first and start the car. See buddy, it's not that bad. We're going to the vet. Are you ready? I had to double check, make sure I had the right cat in the carrier. Dude, having three cats, like you wouldn't think it'd be that much, but it's a lot of work. It's a lot of effort, you know, to keep track of all of them. All right, 30 seconds into the drive. This has never happened with Scar before. Do you hear that? He's never cried like that before in a car. Oh my gosh, buddy, it's okay. We're gonna be home and literally, we're only gonna be out for like 20 minutes. It's gonna be fine. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because Mariah's not here. Maybe Mariah has a special touch because whenever we're in the car with Mariah, he never cries like this, but he's crying in the car with me now. Oh, and by the way, I'm only on my neighborhood roads. I'm not gonna be keeping him here. I'm gonna put him in the back and strap him in because I don't want him to get hurt and stuff. But yeah, he's crying like so loud. I could, like you could hear him outside the car. If I had the windows down. It's okay. <laughs> All right, buddy, we made it. Are you ready to go in? You ready to get some kitty treats and get some shots in you and make you feel healthy? 
<laughs> He's literally just chilling here right now. Oh. Hey buddy, how you doing? So he got his nails trimmed, he got a checkup, he is getting ready to see the doctor now, and he's just chilling with him. He's like, he loves to try to jump around in the room, but I'm trying to keep him on the table just so he doesn't like, you know, wander around. Hi. Oh. <laughs> oh. Did you get a cute computer by the day? Hello. Hello. Guess who it is? What? Oh, you got the gift on the counter? Yeah, hold on. Can you put it up for a second? It was in a bag. I couldn't see it, Marble Squad. Guess who it is? It's Garyville. Hi. I missed you. How was your trip to Naples? Oh, it was good. It just wasn't right without you. Let's let this little man out before my arm falls off and before he goes up. Like they said that since he had shots, he's gonna be super tired and he's probably gonna end up like passing out or something. Passing out? Yeah, passing out, like falling over and fainting. Yeah. Passing no, passing out like going to bad yeah, baby. I, I, Scar! Seems tired. Yeah, I know he was like not chirping at all. He was chirping a lot. Is he okay? Hey! Hey, <laughs> whoa! You're home. No, he's tails up, but he's fine. Scar, hi. Like, Wait, okay. Hi, welcome back. They gave him a shot. So y'all didn't see, but he got two shots. One in his like upper arm area, and one in his lower. His upper did good. His lower, they poked him, and he was like ah, and they had to redo it because he accidentally like moved and it pulled out and stuff. So that was the only one that kind of like felt uncomfortable to him. But okay, he's all good. He's all happy again. Yeah. And Snappy's here with him. Snappy. Ooh. All I gotta say while you were gone, I am gonna be the best future wife you're ever gonna get. Because <laughs> let me just tell you what I got you. It's insane. Can you show me right now? Mm -mm. Can I have it early? Wedding gift. Well, they were all saying I'm shocked you're not giving it to him early. Dude, I but want it right now. I don't know no. what it is, but I want it. I, I, well, like, he has an idea. Give me a he, hint. He has no idea what it actually is. No hints? I can't give you a hint. No, you oh, have to wait. Oh you my gosh. Y'all, I'm, I'm trying to guess what it is. I don't know what it is. All but... I gotta say, insane. Nothing we've ever purchased before. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. That's all I gotta say. You spoiled me on my ring, and so I gotta spoil you with something else. Okay. <laughs> no, bro, you're gonna be. <laughs> look, she's so. No, you're gonna look good. It's gonna be so. Oh my god, I can't freaking wait! <laughs> Your girl got McDonald's. I know it's not the healthiest, but I was starving, and we have no food. We actually need to go girl shopping today. Like, we go, we gonna go? Oh, we do have to go. No, we should go today. Yeah, we, we literally have not had food for like a week and a half almost. Like no, and we worry. were gone in Tampa all weekend, so we didn't have any chance to go roast shopping. We have literally zero food. Yesterday I was trying to like have a snack, no snacks I could eat, like nothing healthy, nothing, absolutely nothing. Mm. <sighs> Get used to eating this bad food today because it's not gonna happen again. It's not terrible for you. It's not terrible. Chicken. It's, it's bad. Processed chicken. But yeah, processed chicken. Has some chicken in it. <laughs> but you guys, we wanted to explain to you why we titled the video the way that we titled it. I think you should share more because you kind of were not traumatized more, but you were like very, very depressed in a, in a way. I was disappointed, if that makes sense. Yeah. So as you guys know, Scar is a black smoke Maine Coon. A uh, black smoke is just like a black and gray type of cat. A badass freaking yeah. cat. Any Maine Coon is badass. That's all I gotta say. Like, I oh, love yeah, any color, any color Maine Coon. Like, you can't go wrong with any color. Like, I've seen so many cute ones. But this was, like, my ultimate dream first Maine Coon that I wanted. And most of the time, they're charged way higher because they're in higher demand and it's very hard to get a smoke. So that's why we were charged up in the higher rank. But, okay. So he's full, a full bred, full blooded, so full blooded European Maine Coon. Maine Coon. He's 100% Maine Coon. Black smoke is just the color. It has, no, yeah, it has nothing to do with anything. But when I first reached out to the breeder, I said, "Hey, I'm looking for a black smoke." So she sent me a few options, a few pictures of different ones that she had available. Scar was like the darker of the black smokes. Like there was other black smokes that already had like the light in them. But we chose Scar because Scar, I don't know, that something was leading us towards him. He, he was, was so cute as a he kitten. He was masculine. We'll pop up some pictures right here too. Look at look at this little baby as a kitten. He's the most like precious no, thing in the world. No, he, he's exotic. 
And that's what she kept saying to me. Like, she's like, I haven't had a black smoke look like him before. Like, he's very exotic. He's very different. She's like, I'm really curious how he's gonna grow up. She never seen one grow up as this color as a yeah, kid. Yeah, like. So she was already like, oh, I wonder how he's gonna look. He's not gonna be like a normal black smoke, but he's definitely gonna be a black smoke because yeah. he's gray and black. So. When he was really little too, he had a lot of grays, a lot of grays, like hair and everything. And also, I think it's also because he's growing out, so it's not as impacted. But Madeline's mom has a black smoke. And so I texted her the other day and I was like, hey, like the, their cat's name is Vito. I was like, what did Vito look when he was three months old? And she sends me a video and a picture and he looks way lighter than Scar. And I'm like, wait, Scar's only getting darker. I was like, I'm a little confused because because shouldn't he be lightening up? So after I was texting Madeline's mom, I ended up reaching out to the breeder and I was like, hey, like, you know, I love this lady. She's the sweetest lady ever, like the best breeder. Like if I was to get another Maine Coon, I would definitely go through her. Like she is just so down to earth, so sweet. I we love, love this her. woman. Like we, st like we never disliked her because no. of the situation. We still love her to No, death. I just wanted to emphasize that. Like Yeah, I... it was just a crazy situation that everyone was confused. Yeah, so when I sent her the video of Scar, I was like, is he supposed to be lighting up? And she She's like, oh my gosh, yeah, you're right. He should be. Like, he's got a lot more darks than grays. Now, on Scar, he has a lot of grays on his belly and his chest. So she reaches out to the other breeder who breeds with her, and she was like, oh my God, you sold her an all black cat. Like, he's That's a, what all the breeders said. Yeah, she's like, he's solid, he's solid black. And so she gets on the phone with me. She's like feeling terrible. She's like, oh my gosh. She was like, she's like tearing up, crying. Yeah, because she's, she's like, I can't believe I sold you a black cat thinking it was going to be a black smoke and charging you for a black smoke. Yeah, and she felt terrible. She actually refunded me. Not the whole thing. No, no like, she refunded me a couple hundred dollars. Like but, what would average a, a black cat? Yeah, like which was so Super, super Which sweet. we didn't expect at all. We didn't, like honestly did not expect anything. We were still obviously gonna love Scar and keep oh, him no matter what. Listen, he's gonna be badass but and handsome no matter what. She just wanted to go the extra mile and, and help us. Yeah, which was yeah. which was really, really, really sweet on her end. But the more we keep looking at Scar, we still are really confused if he is going to lighten up. Because like I said, under his belly and under his neck, he has gray hairs growing in. And if you pull back his fur, if you actually look within his fur, there's gray hair. But we didn't notice this until like a day ago. Yeah. So we are honestly don't know how he's gonna turn out. It might sound bad, but I was obviously disappointed because like I paid for something, you know, like when you go through a breeder, you pay for what you want. Okay, it's like we love Scar no matter what. So if you order the new iPhone 15 in white, but then it came in and it was black. You love the phone, you're still gonna love it, but you're, you're like, oh, I wish the color was what I wanted. Yeah. Now, now that we have Scar, we love the black, we love, you know, the black Mancoon. It took me a minute to process. It but, took me a minute to like, feel it. Like, okay, like I was a little disappointed. I was like, oh my gosh, like what? Like whatever. I was super, you were super down. But, like, in the sense of like, yeah. like I can't believe after years of wanting, wanting a black like, smoke, it, we got a black smoke, but then it's not going to be a smoke. It's just going to be like a black hat, which yeah. is fine, but. And the more I just kept thinking about it, I love Scar so much. He is my freaking baby. I don't care how he turns out, honestly. Like, I've come to terms with it. Like, honestly, I'm excited if he's going to be all black because we looked up all black main coons. They still look badass. Oh my gosh, they are sick. And he has orange eyes. He's going to be the most handsome, he badass does. cat. Bro, he will. He's like he the will. definition Halloween cat. Bro, he is. Halloween is like one of our top two favorite holidays. Yeah. So. So, and he's gonna grow into his mane. A lot of that takes like nine months. He's only three months. I really think he's still growing out his grays because I was looking at him the other day and I'm like, his gray is like growing out. Yeah. It started black, but then the rest of his fur is like it's gray around weird. certain areas. weird. Like she said, he's very exotic. Um, if for some reason he does end up being a smoke, I am gonna refund her back the money. Yeah, I was like, because then he's a smoke. Like, I don't wanna say I jumped the like gun that. too early. Maine Coons, if you guys don't know Maine Coons, they change so fast and they can change in a month. They can look totally different. But if you look at him right now, he looks like a black cat. He, he does, does not look like a, a, a black smoke. You have to like go up to, close to him to really see his like Yeah, coloring. in certain areas maybe a little bit. So but. we're gonna have to see. We don't know for sure. It's kind of just like a waiting game, but honestly, I'm really excited to see him grow up and I'm gonna love him no matter what. I've come to terms with it. Like, and I also wanna say, I know last time in the last video, you guys were like, don't shop 
adopt. The thing is, we've adopted so many cats. Like, we have, I feel like we've done a lot. We've adopted like seven cats. Seven we don't cats. own seven, but like, we Gifted. adopted them for my mom, mom yeah. for her sister, um, another one so for her sister. We're, we're known for adopting, yeah. but when it comes to these type of cats, like, they go up for adoption too. Like, the breeder's selling them and putting them up for adoption. So, I feel like it's like the same thing in a way. Obviously, we wanted Scar. He's my dream cat. And the only way I can get him is if I go through a breeder. It's very hard to find these type of breeds. Yeah, it's in like a finding shelter. a Frenchie. Like you, it's so it's hard. So you, you're hard. not gonna find them, or they're gonna go right away. Or but like, trust me, yeah. I am all for adopting. Like mm -hmm. I love adopting. That's what we did for Snap and Thor. Like yeah. we're all for that. And you know, we're not the type of that just like, oh, we want a certain cat. Like we're only mm -hmm. gonna shop around. Like no, like that's not us. Like we feel horrible. We've adopted more cats than an average human being yeah. will in their lifetime. So so I just want to yeah. clarify that, Eric, because I know many of you guys were like upset about that, but a lot of you guys maybe knew the channel might not have known like how many cats we've actually adopted. Yeah, our whole history goes way back. Yeah. But we love him to death. Everything's turning out great. I'm so excited. If we did make this video two, three days ago, it would have been totally different Mariah than you see now. It wasn't even I was disappointed in him because <clears throat> I love him. Like he is literally my freaking baby. I literally can't leave his side. Like I just love him so much. I think it was more so the color scheme I was going for and was my vision. Mm -hmm. um, it wasn't anything towards him. Like it was just, it was just a disappointment. You know, yeah. like it was like just like not what I expected, but I've come to terms with it and no, I'm excited. No, now we're in love with him. No, now I love. He's absolutely perfect. I've been in love with him, but I'm just saying, like the color wise, like oh my god, like I'll be happy with either way. Yeah, no, I'll be I'll be even more happy oh. with if he just grows the way he Guys, grows. Maine Coons, it literally does not matter the color. They are so handsome. Like I really want an orange polydactyl. With I don't know if you guys know what a polydactyl is, but they have a multiple toe. No polydactyl, they have an oh, extra. They have an extra, extra toe. toe. And they, oh. their paws are like even bigger. Oh, they are so cute. Uh, that's gonna be our next one. In the future. In the yeah. future. And also, she was asking the breeder, she was like, I can give you another smoke. And I was like, no, we can't have four cats. No, we could not do four cats right no. now. No. Four, as much as we enough. love, love animals, we can't. But yeah, guys, we wanted to give you guys that update. And also, I know we haven't talked about this in the last video, but we are still doing the oh, yes. giveaway for hitting three million on YouTube. Once again, like, we are not forgetting about this. We are doing this giveaway we want to thank I you guys by for all month. of your help i feel like we're gonna give away like a bunch of stuff maybe like a couple of apple watches mm -hmm. or you know whatever you guys we should do some apple watches or we iPhones. should do like a whole bunch of like stuff like because i don't want to just do one i rather we could do, do iphone apple watch and then maybe a computer or something something like that or we like should do a, so, yeah something along those lines so stay i want tuned. to do yeah we are doing that so stay tuned for future details make sure to subscribe to our channel give the video a thumbs up so you can remember and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss out on the video coming up that we are announcing how to get entered into this giveaway yes because i really want to get back to you guys you guys mean the absolute world mm -hmm. to us we wouldn't be here without you guys and no. literally the purchase i just made today is the prime example of why i am just so blessed and thankful for every single one We're of so you for making our dreams literally come to life i know you all say like you know it, it just goes a long way that we're here making videos for y'all and like you could see our life on day to day but like we wouldn't be who we are honestly you molded Dude, us into like better people i was getting emotional when i was at the place today because i was just like oh my gosh like it's so crazy to see where me and you started working at a grocery store together like i don't know it's just it's mind-blowing it i hope really we can is. also motivate a lot of you to like you know chase your dreams um, you know, what, whatever career or um, dream that you have, like it, it means a lot that we can have that effect on a lot of you because mm -hmm. as you have had on us. Yeah. So we're really excited and happy and I just can't wait for our wedding day, guys. Five more months. Dude, you have no months? idea. Wait, see what it is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Out. I can't even freaking believe it. Like it's it. almost oh. exactly five months in a couple days. And I get my LASIK soon. And she gets her eyes surgically lasered. Which I'm really freaking nervous for. But <laughs> That's for another video. Yeah. But you guys, I hope you enjoyed our video today. And we're gonna go grocery shopping and get some food in our stomachs. Yeah, we need food. Cause if you saw our fridge, it just looks like lights and shelves. Yeah. There's, there's nothing else in between. <laughs> but you guys, we'll see you in the next video. But until, until then, then, peace. Love you guys. guys.